black hoodie, I'm back cooking these goodies. Look at these views from cooking these foods. Yeah. All right, we're coming in hot. We're going dirty today. We're doing a McCheat meal. I haven't had a cheeseburger, a burger, something with a bun like this. I don't know when the last time I had McDonald's was. At least, I would say, two months, if not longer. So this should be a treat. I just wanted McDoubles aplenty. So I've got the two here dressed like a Mac. And then two are just regular with uh, lettuce, tomato, and mayo added to it. So let's go for maybe this middle guy straight away. I'm excited just to like really smash, smash these hella hard. Pickle, onion, all that goodness, plus lettuce, tomato, mayo, pickle, or to make lettuce, tomato, it, you know what I mean. Wow. Absolutely heavenly. Sloppy rare. Extremely hungry right now. Now it's got to hit a hit a pickle on that one. Sometimes you just want burgers. <laughs> a lot of times back in the day. This would be a pretty standard style order for me at McDonald's just because It's a good amount of food for, for the for the price. Even though these uh, McDoubles and things are getting a little more pricey, like everything, but uh, four of these was fifteen bucks. Mmm. This is an absolute classic staple like life hack the mcdouble like a mac i personally think it low-key is better sometimes because the meat the sauce to bun and all that ratio it just seems more balanced sometimes a regular Big Mac it's too much bun So good. This mac sauce is, it's just magical. Absolutely magical. This is like a quick 2,000 calories. <laughs>
but deeply fasted, only meal for the day. So we're okay. We good. Almost a little bit in and out looking, though McDonald's. Extremely on point. Like my weekend was, with my sister's birthday, had a fam jam. Cousin brought over a projector. Got it set up in the yard and had like a October spooky, <laughs> watch the new Halloween movie. In my opinion, all Halloweens after the first are inferior. They're just, I don't know. They're just never as good. That first one is just the, the main ticket. Same thing as like Jurassic Park for me and shit like that. Why don't you get a taste of the original? It's really hard to, uh, to appreciate the uh, the sequels. At least for me. A lot of it, you just, you get wrapped in the, like you wanna, that feeling of what you get, that nostalgic feeling of how you used to how it scared you as a kid and just how you felt when you were younger watch it the follow-ups never can, can never do that to you again it feels like I overestimated my appetite. It was one of those times where I'm so hungry, I thought I could eat. Eat four of these, but it's gonna be three all day, but that's gonna be a beautiful bite. That pickle and tomato and mayo, that juiciness right there. Have to be a uh, savor the flavor on that one. There's no way I fit to fit it in right now. I'm stuffed. Absolutely stuffed. But yeah, backyard outdoor movie screenings with a fire pit. That energy is unmatched. Like so enjoyable. A little bit cold out. Have blankets, a little fire. In the spooky, the darker, you know what I mean? Just nighttime energy. That was really fun. And I spent literally all day, like I made the dinner and I just, I was like on my feet, like prepping, getting things ready all day. All for that 20 minute meal where everybody eats for 20 minutes and then it's just like it's over <laughs> but it's worth it there's like enjoyment in the process like i enjoy the process and then making it and presenting it to people you know hosting hospitality it's like an enjoyable 20 minutes even though it takes like you know seven hours <laughs> All right, hopefully you enjoyed the little cheat with me. Also, just a quick shout out. I meant to say it at the top of the video, but I forgot. To the people who came through to the GoFundMe that I put up and have uh, donated, thank you so much. Really, really appreciate it. Um, Y'all the real MVPs, 
you give a guy hope and uh, that's dope. So thank you very much. Appreciate it. Till the next one, you know what to do. Eat good, live well. Stay true. If you like this content, please like, comment, and subscribe, as well as check out my pinned comment down below to find other ways to support this channel. Thank you for watching. Eat good, live well, and stay true.